Hi family and welcome to this video and if you welcome to my channel don't forget to subscribe and be part of Didi family and today I'm very excited of course like I always am in every video I'm going to try the new revolution mattifying primer now I have kind of combo skin my t-zone is very oily and I do prefer mattifying primers mattifying foundations um, yeah I like that I like that because during the day my oils are coming through also on my eyelids and I look like a, cre a greasy mess and I don't like that. So for a long time I've been liking Hourglass Veal, I think Mineral, mineral Primer Oil Free. Really like this, I'm almost done with this one. And I saw on Instagram the Revolution came out with a couple of different primers. It, it was this one, it was Luminate. Uh, luminous I think and one more perfecting something I don't know a couple of different primers but matte fine got, got my eye so I'm going to try that on half of my face and the other half I'm going to use this Bill Hourglass primer to compare these two because when I first started my channel I used the primer that I wanted to review on all, the whole of my face but some of you subscribers or some of you, my friends and family, told me that you prefer when I do half face with the new primer, half face with primer that I've been using, just to compare and see if there is really a difference. And this is a very big difference in price, so it's going to be interesting. I've been liking this primer from Revolution Pro Primer that's also new, and I'm almost done with it. Really, I have maybe two uses. And the only thing I don't like with this is that this color, this black, goes on my fingers and leaves black dots everywhere. And I, when I apply my makeup or primer on the skin, I get black dots all over my skin. So I'm very excited. I'm going to try this. Today I'm filming two different videos. I'm going to film this one. And also I got the two new Revolution eyeshadow primer. So I'm going to compare these two also. So if you want to see that, that's coming on my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you get notified when that video comes out on my channel or up on my channel. This English makes me confused sometimes. But let's start, stop talking and let's start using the primer. So this is supposed to be matte and keep my oils in control the whole day. And I really like the hourglass. I do look a little bit luminous at the end of the day, but that's not terrible. I just I just don't like to be look greasy. So let's see. Matte packaging. I hope this won't come out. So I'm going to use revolution on this one and hourglass on this one. So let's see. This is also cruelty free. The revolution one. Oh, this is Citra. Oh, feels like a gel. I already have a skincare on my skin. Oh, it feels more like silicone -y, like that smash box. I don't know if this is going to keep my oils in place. I hope. I don't know how much should I apply. When I look at myself in the mirror right now, I can see that this side is a little bit more matte than the other side. Let's go to the next side. I like this packaging more. Then I'll go in with my hourglass. On this side with the other hand. And I'm going to go out and it's raining outside. And that wet weather also makes my skin look fringy and oily. This feels more like silk. And I got this mirror in dollar store. Some of you, my family, asked me. Uh, okay, I like... I know, it looks the same. So I'm going to go in with the foundation. I'm going to use this... Isadora all day wear makeup 24 hours. This is also a good foundation that is sweat and uh, humidity proof, fragrance free, cruelty free, and uh, sweat proof, 
long lasting for four hours all free for all skin types so but i do look a little bit shiny not greasy at the end of the day not too much but i want to see i always use a little bit of mattifying foundations too so let's go in with this one It went on nice. Let's go to the other side. So everything went on nice. I'm going to go in with uh, my sponge. I'm going to go in just to make everything look more flawless and even, to be sure. I really like how the foundation goes on, on this side. It goes on very nice and even, I like that. Really like, and my pores look very, very small. Surprise! Never, I didn't expect that with this primer. My camera is messing with me all the time. I don't like that. I don't. I can't afford a new one. I really like how my foundation looks so nice on this side. On this side where the that new primer is. On this side, I already know that it's going to look good. I'm used to using this primer. This side is with the new mattifying primer from Revolution. And this side is an hourglass. So I'm going to go in with this Jouvet Essential High Coverage Liquid Concealer that I got and reviewed in my last video. I really like this concealer. I like when my concealer is a lighter shade or two or three shades lighter than my skin tone or my foundation because I look to look bright under my eyes. I look awake. I look more awake. I'm going to set this everything and finish my makeup and I'll be back to give you my full thoughts. Right now it's 11.45 so I'm going to finish my makeup and see you soon. Okay, so I'll be having this on for almost an hour because it's 12.45 and um, there is no difference between these two. No difference at all. Maybe, just maybe my pores look less visible on the side with, with um, our glass primer, but this side with this matte doesn't look bad either. So we are going to wear this for a couple of hours and I'll be back to do a um, check-in and tell you my thoughts after a couple of hours if it's going to work and keep my oils in place which I really hope I did bake under my eyes I did set it with the beauty powder because I do bake over, almost every day every day when I use the use the foundation or yeah use the makeup. So and this is these two hourglass against mattifying revolution primer can't speak right now and we'll see i hope there i hope this will be a winner because it's cheaper it's cheaper i don't know but i really like my hourglass definitely going to repurchase it in the future because it does keep my skin look nice and beautiful always get compliments when i use that primer but we'll see we'll see i'll be back and see you in a couple of seconds hi we are back and it's almost 8 30 and are we having this foundation or primer on for i think eight hours seven eight hours and it's time for me to take my foundation off i'm tired and i need to 
get ready for the work tomorrow. But on this side, I have the matte, the new matte and fixed primer from Mattify from Revolution. And on this side, I do have this Veal Mineral Primer All Free from Hourglass. Okay, this is the results. I haven't touched up. I tried not to touch my face a lot today. And this is how it looks. So be honest, guys. What do you think? The difference is that I think they do look very similar when I look in the mirror right now. But I have to say that this one, this side here, is just a little bit more matte than this one. This is more luminous, more, more oily here, especially here close to the nose. They are very similar, but this one is just a little bit more matte or less oily. Less oily, it's better to say. Less oily than this one. Uh, let me see very close. The foundation is there, the co contour is there, the bronze is there, highlighter is there, the makeup is there, didn't move, didn't sink into my fine lines. Everything looks nice. Um, my pores look nice, the nose looks nice. Even foundation around here is still there. I do like it, of course, where I have my glasses, it's never going to be there. But this is how it looks. Didn't sink here, that's very good, looks beautiful. I love it. I love the primer. I'm very, very happy. I'm definitely going to try the pore minimizer too, just to see if I can get rid of the pores. They're not very visible, they look just the same as on this side with the the hourglass primer. So if you're looking for something like this, with this finish, go and try this one. I think you're gonna like it because this is how it looks. I think it's good. So guys, I'm really happy that this worked out, this primer. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit that notification bell, push the like button and don't forget to subscribe. And I hope I see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye.